Hey everybody, welcome back to Women Carry Knives. On the table in front of me, I did not do a mail call on this one. I was so excited to get it. I thought it was just a great surprise to come home to one day. Um, we have got the Medium Honey Badger. Um, this came courtesy of SMKW, along with, ooh, you'd be so excited, new stickers. Check those out, I love them. So, whoops, too far back there. Just loving these. So you guys know I do giveaways, courtesy of Smoky Mountain Knife Works. Um, for those of you that don't know, we'll just cover up my sticker right there. Um, I am an ambassador, so they do on occasion send me some knives to review. And I send them right back to you guys. Um, because, you know, it's just a nice way to give back. And I know everybody loves it. Uh, so I got some great stickers to be giving out. We got the Sharper Things and the New Blade stickers. These are just, I, so one of these are staying with me because these are just cool. I really love these. Uh, but without further ado, <clears throat> let's talk about this Honey Badger. I love this little Honey Badger. This thing, it is just, it's such a great knife. I mean, talk about a simple blade. This is just great. It's a drop point blade. It's got a full flat grind on it. Um... It feels as though it's pretty darn sharp. Um, I I don't like to renew my uh, renew review my knives unless I actually carry them. So, you know, I have used this, so I've had it for a few days. I'm not gonna lie, um, I have been carrying it around, and so far, I really am in love with this thing. So I didn't know much about Honey Badger. Um, but I have to say that, you know, I'm impressed. And I am sorry, this thing is very dirty. Because, like I said, there's smudge marks and all kinds of stuff on it. But, so, for the cutting I've been doing, you know, it still feels really sharp, which is a good thing. So, I'm really happy with that. Uh, it's a D2 blade, so D2 steel. You have three options for opening this. And this is what I love. So, first off, it is steel uh, liner, so it's a liner lock just in case you didn't know, FRN handles with this, almost I would call a honeycomb pattern, which is awesome because it does give you that little bit of uh, grip on there, which is really nice. I love how they have the handle come, cut out so you can get to the liner lock really easy, and that makes a big difference to me. I love that. Um, there is a bit of jimping on the flipper tab, but not too deep it's it's you know very fine which I really like there is jimping on your blade up here and there's a little bit of jimping on the handle also and that's gonna let you really choke up on this thing I love it um, like I said you do have three ways to open it so it is a flipper tab so obviously you can flip it you also have what they refer to as a thumb hole so you know maybe you're bored you want to thumb hole it there you go and this one is small but you can actually well no we got stuck on that one you can actually spidey flick this one too. So, I mean, this is all around great for me because this is just an awesome fidget knife too. Um, your red backspacers, I love that. It adds a little touch of color, a little pop of color there. And of course, you know, one of my favorite colors is red next to purple. So those are my two favorites. You have the steel, stainless steel liner or stainless steel clip. This is a deep carry. I mean, this is crazy. This is absolutely crazy. We're going to use one of their stickers. Nope, we're not because I don't want to ruin that. So let's reach across the table here. You cannot see the knife. It has disappeared. I love that. Now, I've heard about Honey Badger. Hadn't heard that much about it. I've heard some good things. Um, so I was super excited when, like I said, when I got home and this was in the mail. Some of the specs on this, your blade length is about three and a quarter inches with a full three inch cutting edge. That's just awesome. You just can't beat that. Um, your handle length, let's do a closed length on this. And yeah, that's perfect. Your closed length is just about four inches. So this I would consider, I would consider this a small knife, small to medium. Um, overall, of course, we said three and four, so you're looking at about one, two, three, four, five, six, yep, seven and a quarter inches. That's really good. Now, if we compare that 
to the bug out, you're basically talking the same size. Okay, for those of you that like large knives, we can compare it to the Ontario Rat 1. So you can see the size difference. It is not by any means a big knife. It's not by any means a small, small knife. It is definitely a medium sized knife, but I have to tell you. And this knife, I'll leave the link down there. Um, the I'll leave the link down in the description. Description. I'm sorry about that. This is, um, you can find this on Smoky Mountain Knife Works for $60. So you really can't go wrong. I mean, $60 for a great knife. You know, not everybody can afford the expensive knives. So I love to be able to review um, higher end knives. I love to be able to review budget knives. Um, this is a great budget knife. I'm really loving it. Um, it's been, like I said, it's just been a lot of fun to carry. Um, I like the fact that it sits in my pocket really well. It sits in there uh, deep, which is awesome. I have a couple that stick out in kind of an odd way. And it does get a little um, annoying at times. But this one, all around, and I love a good drop point blade. And this, this is it. Um, also, it does have a lanyard hole for those of you that do like lanyards. I really can't say enough about this one. Um, I know I said that about my last one, but wow, this one is just, you know, it's a blast. It's a flicker, it's a flipper, it's a thumber. <laughs> uh, it's fun. It's really fun. This is definitely one to add to the collection. For the price, I mean, you really, you cannot go wrong. You really can't. Thank you so much, Smoky Mountain Knife Works, for the opportunity to review this knife or having it. Um, again, you guys will be seeing and more giveaways. You'll be seeing some new swag in there. Uh, the Stranger Things, love that. The Blades sticker, love that. And of course, our Smoky Mountain Knife Works. If you are not following them, if you are not following SmokyMountainKnifeWorks.com or Facebook page, SMKW Army, or watching their live videos, um, Guys Talk Live, that is a fun one. If you guys want to learn about knives, different knives, that is a great one to get on every Thursday. Um, check it out. They also do, uh, Tuesdays, they do some blade reviews too. Um, great, great site, great people. Um, having the pleasure, it's an absolute pleasure to be an ambassador for them. Um, I, I mean, working with them, they're 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 a great company. They have just been awesome. So I I can't say enough about the company. I can't say enough about the people that work there. Uh, again, it's it's an absolute pleasure. Also, just so you guys know, I'm going to leave the affiliate link down there in my uh, description. Um, if you guys see something that you like, and I leave a link for that knife down to Smoky Mountain Knife Force, uh, feel free to use the affiliate link. And any of the money that I get from that goes right back into the community, goes right back into purchasing knives for the giveaways, and I send it right back out to you guys. Because really, um, to me, it's a lot more fun to give and to, to really make somebody's day brighter by being able to send them a little something, you know, um, a knife with some swag in there. And, um, yeah, I mean, that's that's what it's really all about, right? Sharing and giving back to the community. Well, thank you, everybody, so much for joining me. Again, this has been the Medium Honey Badger. Um, fabulous, fabulous knife. If you get a chance, please check this one out. Um, if you guys are on a budget, $60. This is great. You cannot go wrong. Absolutely love it. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to, to leave it down in the comments section. If you're not a subscriber, I'd love to have you here all that time, all the time. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. As you guys know, I do not edit my videos, so this has been a little bit off, but that's okay. I've gotten to the point. Get it? Get it? Thank you so much for joining me. Until next time.